Hey everybody, it's Neely and Renee coming in actually for Wellness Wednesday today, but uh, I didn't have a whole lot to update on my diet and all that going on with me. Basically just chugging along with uh, what I'm doing and um, no weight loss this week, but that's pretty typical for this time of the month. Kind of, I have like one week of the month where uh, I tend to drop weight and this is not one of those weeks, but still going strong, feeling good. Um, so since I didn't have a lot to update, on that, I decided to uh, talk about Renee's eyes and do a little update on, on her eyes and how things are going with her vision therapy. And you can see she's got her new glasses now. We picked those up just like three days ago and they have been so great so far. We got the tomato brand glasses that I've heard really great things about. They have a strap on the back like the Miraflex did, um, but it's an optional strap. So there's ways to adjust it so you don't have the strap. And um, there's different nose pieces you can get. And I ordered a couple different ones because the one that it came with um, didn't fit very well on her face. And right now she has no nose piece, which works pretty well, but I'm gonna try out the other nose pieces and see how that goes. Um, and then see if we can just stop using the strap uh, with the nose piece, see how that works. So that's all going really great. What if? Oh when we wear all of the nose piece on it it will stay uh not wobbly i think yeah it wouldn't be wobbly if you had the nose piece because it keeps it right where it's supposed to be yeah i think so if I we put so. all of them on well that would be too many because then it would be sticking out like here oh that would be crazy Yes. <laughs> so anyways, we just came out of Renee's uh, progress exam with the doctor. So she has her vision therapy that she goes to every other week. And um, the vision therapist that she has is actually also a doctor, which is great. Um, but then we also have an, a neuro-ophthalmologist that is in the same office that we go to see every six appointments so that's every 12 weeks and so we just had that appointment this morning what are you doing sticking your tongue out i don't know <laughs> and it was so encouraging i nearly cried in the appointment um renee is making so much improvement her uh, eye alignment is so much better she still switches back and forth between her right and left eye uh, but both eyes are moving really well uh, like the the muscles are all loosened up so she can use both eyes which is great uh, when we first started her left eye was really really tight and she was primarily using her right eye so um, having that all loosened up is fantastic and then in the appointment today she actually was able to use both eyes together there's uh, red and green glasses that they use for a lot of vision therapy exercises and tests and she had those red and green glasses on and she was able to see um, a red and green light mixed she said she could see it mixed because before it'd just be alternating she'd see the green one or she'd switch to see the red one depending on which eye she was looking through green. can we find the red one I found the red one. Mm -hmm. Can you find the green one? Uh, green one. I see them both. Oh, you do. Are, can you sh point at the red one for me? Uh -huh. Where's the green one? Uh, uh, like this. Wait, are they in the same spot? No. They got switched. Oh, they switch from red to green? Yes. Can you find them both, or is it only one at a time? Uh, I see green mixed with red. And um, she was actually able to get it to mix and she could see them both at the same time so that was really really encouraging the doctor said she had never been able to get her to do that up to this point so it's obvious that we're making really good progress and it was it was just so encouraging she also said that the glasses that we chose were a really good choice um and like taking a break from the binasal occlusion we had the little frosting here um between the eyes on the other glasses uh, to help her eyes, you know, learn where they're supposed to sit. Uh, but we're taking a break from that and things look really good without them right now. So we are just so encouraged with the progress we've made and we're just continuing to plow forward. It's not a quick process. It's going to take a lot of time still and that's what we knew going into it, probably a two or three year process and we're coming up on a year at the end of the summer. So we're not even a year in and um, we're already seeing so much progress and things are going so well. So that is all that we wanted to update on today. I hope you guys are all doing really great. 
And we're going to keep working hard on these little eyeballs to get them healthy and strong. And we will talk to you again real soon. Say bye. Bye.